frequently people use the words deafness or hearing loss interchangeably to address people with having some amount of hearing difficulty unaware of the fact how a person would feel today we'll be discussing how different people with a hearing loss see their problem differently hi i am dr prabha unadkar founder of quality hearing care mumbai we've been working with the people with hearing loss over last 35 years now various degree of hearing loss affect the ability to hear and communicate both hard of hearing as well as deaf describe people with some amount of hearing loss but do not explain the same thing identifying themselves as a deaf is socially acceptable to people suffering from severe to profound hearing loss they either do not significantly benefit from technology or decide not to use it they use sign language as their main mode of communication including finger spelling facial expressions and body language they have their cultural and linguistic group furthermore they expect privileges and benefits and do not mind calling them self as a group of deaf there are institutes using sign language for education and they use interpreters for communicating with hearing people hard of hearing the group of people who suffer from mild to severe hearing loss at times it also includes profound deafness they are generally in denial about their hearing problem and suffer from stigma attached to accepting it they are willing to use technology to assist their hearing and they benefit with it to a various extent limitation in both are very frustrating and they have to put in lots of extra effort in educational career and social integration into hearing work they bounce back using for the technology putting in more effort to overcome their limitation they do not like to be marginalized or deprived of the opportunities available to people with hearing they do not like to be called deaf the third group is the one who believes in total communication the philosophy of the total communication is to use both sign language as well as speech for communication this is supposed to reduce the limitation imposed by use of only sign language this has given you some idea how people with hearing loss struggle to be a part of a hearing society we have to understand their needs and help them empathetically to overcome it if you found this video interesting please give thumbs up give your comments below and ask questions please do not forget to subscribe to our channel for further information Thank you and take